Who else have I got alive? No one. I can't. Oh god, I'm just gonna be stuck in a loop of using revives and getting downed again. Because you can just fucking get all my Pokemon in one go. Um, Super Potion, Run DMC. You should not be able to kill Run DMC in one hit, I'm sorry. You, have, you shouldn't have anything that should be able to do that, I don't think. Drum beating, okay. Grass type move. Why is that so powerful? What the fuck move is that? What's his base power? It's like hit me with a fucking solar beam. If anyone can actually look up that move, drum beating, because I don't know what it is or how to beat it. I don't get why it's so powerful or what its drawback is. Damn. Go charge back into you again. Just bump my head against you until I can figure out how to overcome drum beating. Like, holy shit. Oh, well, though. Fast travel, please. Alright, yeah, now this game's actually gotten really fucking hard now. It's hard to breeze through anyway. Usually in Pokemon games, it's quite hard. It's quite easy to kind of skim just the major encounters and not grind too much, but this one, I think it wants you to do a little grinding. Or in my case, like, just, you know, instead of, like, trying to catch those different Pokemon and raise them all, just go with your team of six, but... That's not how I do, sadly. I try to show off as many different ones as I can, so... How the fuck do you beat that drum beating move? <laughs> He's so powerful, it's ridiculous. Um, well, what I am going to do is... i to see if I can go into that part of the battle with a buffed Pokemon. Power of 8? That was not a power of 80. Power of 8 should not have been able to fucking down me in one hit like that. No way. What the fuck? What's its, what is that Pokemon's attack stat though? Is it like Machamp high? Is it like 140 or something ridiculous like that? Because to kill me with an 80 base power move from full health is like absurd. That's way more powerful than it should be. It's got to have some like beefy ass attack or something. Or maybe my um, run DMC just has awful defense, maybe? I don't know, it's one of the two. It's got to be one of the two. Anyway. 125! Damn, that is high! Alright, that might explain things then. That's high for a starter. Oof. Alright. So I just basically just... I'm just kind of getting overpowered by shit now. But that, thankfully, he's not starting off with a critical hit. So I can beat him with false surrender. Better start to the battle. Everything else should play out better by proxy. There we go. Level ups for all. Snorlax. Right, Snorlax, I'm gonna paralyze. There we go. Alright, I like that the game's actually now because of, you know, the fact that I haven't grinded and I'm circling through Pokemon, this has actually gotten hard. It's now fun and challenging. I like it. This is probably not the ideal way to play, but hey, this is how I do. Um, let's go in with... Uh, what should I go in with? I'm taking down a Snorlax. If I get Echo to start honing claws... And then by the time Rillaboom gets to me, if I'm at full health, I can one-shot him with, uh, with Drill Peck. That's the hope, anyway. That's the antis That's the idea, the anticipation. Let's see, Home Claws. Let's use a lot of this. Healing if I must. And get my buffs on. I'd like to have, like, Sword Stance, or maybe, you know, something a bit more useful than just attack and accuracy going up, but fuck me! Ooh! That's not like hits heavy in the heart. He thought he would. Alright, um... Damn it! Gotta get myself. Alright, he's not gonna let me buff myself up. And he's just gonna keep body slamming me even though he's paralyzed. He's gonna ignore his paralysis. It's gonna be one of those situations. Alright, um... The Og hurt. Get in there and... Butter up the Snorlax. I know the worst thing to do is throw food at a Snorlax, but that's what I'm doing. 
I'm gonna let, let Snorlax be defeated by his one true love, food. Attract. There we are, that's better. Nice. Now he's paralyzed and he's confused and he's attracted. I'm not gonna let this motherfucker move. I'm not letting the Snorlax even get the chance. I'm gonna make it statistically impossible for him to move. And he's still gonna do it anyway at some point and probably body me. Alright, Confucian did go through. Wow! Game! That was just a cheat. You just cheated there. That was like that was like a 5% chance that was gonna go through and it just did immediately. Like on the first turn. <laughs> Fuck me. Wow. Um curse. <laughs> if a doubt curse. If a problem comes along, you must curse it. Curse the Snorlax. Curse this horrible fucking bear. There we are. Now he's stockpiling again, like he did before. Alright. But Curse is also gonna kill him. That's how we beat the Snorlax last time. Alrighty, so. If I bring Run D Impsy back up. Even though I know he can get one shotted by the fucking drums, so I'm not gonna bring him out against uh, Big Boy. Does this have, have his team on a diet of X accuracy? <laughs> that would be amazing. <laughs> oh yeah, he just can't miss. That's his gimmick. That's his trainer ability. He's immune to missing you with anything. Or never not attacking. There we are. Doing better now. Alright, Super Potion. For Jam Mask. There it is. Whoop, there it is. And, oh, nice one. Very good. Right, I'm going to try something interesting now. I'm going to try something very risky. But if it works, then I'm golden. I don't have any. I'm just going to use an X speed and see if I can outspeed him with a curse. <laughs> I'll outspeed um, horrible bastard man when he comes in. Alright, well. Might as well just use it for more healing opportunities. So let's super potion on Echo. Oh, okay. Oh no, he's actually giving me more time. All right, good, very good. And he wasted his hype. He wasted his potion, which I'd rather he do on Snorlax than on uh, Drum Monkey. Rock, goddamn Rillaboom. All right, get rid of the paralysis as well. For Echo. <clears throat> Snorlax is out of confusion. That's not good for me. Don't like that. Ouch. And a crit. Thank you. I critted you. Good for you, you dick. <laughs> Glad. That's what I wanted you to do. Alright. Oh. Okay, well. Giving you that weird ability. Not that's really going to do much. Hmm. Let me see if I can get Yog Hurt back in, and back in the fray as well. <laughs> and am I done here? No, I'm not. Just at low health. All right. All right. Now I've got everyone except for Yamask here at full health. Someone should be able to get through the goddamn Rillaboom. Someone should be able to. If not, I don't even know what to do. I don't know how to fucking get this thing unless I bring bring Cinderace out the computer. And do the steamroll method that I'm so used to. That I've gotten us all used to. Alright, you down, but Snorlax also down. Experience for everybody else. Alrighty. That is good. Level ups. Alright, so I've got Dumbo here. Hmm. Oh, run DMC, but he'll die in one hit. 
Echo, who could do a big hit, but only like once, and then he's kind of... Well, no, Echo could do a big hit with Drill Pet, be down to low health, then I could swap out let someone else get beaten for a while while I heal up Echo. There we are. Oh, Heat more! Oh, yeah, fucking bastard! He spat it on me! I didn't even read that. Okay, well, it's Heat more instead then. Okay. Drill Pet. <laughs> I think the point still applies. My plan still works. Even though you're gonna fire lash me now. Ow. Don't like that. Drill. Peck. Get rid of heat more. No, get rid of heat more. Oh, you bastard. Okay, please tell me that you're faster than heat more at least. Considering you have a choice scarf on. Outspeed heat more. Kill someone, Poker. Come on, Polka. Let's go for a Rock Smash. Just smack him! Yeah! Donk! Nice. Needed that. <laughs> Just wanted that. Just wanted that one moment, please. Alright, good. Next up is Rillaboom, again. But this time coming last. With his horrible big drum, so... Alright. Let us... Get around to reviving and healing up Echo, so Echo could do a big hit. And here comes his drum attack. Which is going to just one-shot everybody. Why is it so goddamn strong? 125, base 80 power. It's a lot. Unless you're straight up resisting it, it's a lot. Go. Hey Dumbo, what up? And uh, super potion for Echo. Oh, hello. He has, he, I don't think he has much to use against Dumbo. Oh wow, he can kill me in one hit with knockoff and it's crit! What the fuck game? Jesus Christ. Alright, he's just. Hmm. It's just a fucking. Endless steamroller of murder, this thing. Just fucking destroys anything in its path. Alright. Um, drill Peck. Don't you fucking dare kill me. Yeah, you got rid of my beak. But that did not kill me. Didn't even get me to half health. Good. Fuck, if I don't finish you off now, you're going to destroy me with the fucking drums because you're going to have Overgrow on them. And when you get the Overgrow ability, I'm not going to even be able to graze you. So I have to use Home Claws, fully heal, and hope that you don't do more than half of my health with any of your attacks. And you missed me! Wow! Good! Good! Yes! I just need to come at you with Echo, with better circumstances. Super Potion on Echo. Nice. And right, you gonna slam me? Oh fuck, how oh, that hurts so much. Why does that hurt so much? Oh, it's a crit. Of course it's a crit. Why wouldn't it be a crit? Hyper potion. Just heal it up. <laughs> Jesus. Stop critting, please. Just for a moment. I need you to not crit for one turn. Alright, good. And finished. Drill peck done. Got your Rillaboom. Ah, I avoided it even better. Drill peck done. Got him. Nice. And that is you finished off. Echo's level 39, York gets 36. Wait, are you not done? Oh, there's another? Oh, yeah, the Bolt Hunt. How did I forget the Bolt Hunt? This is the one where I had to curse. I cursed the Bolt Hunt. I cursed the Doggo. I'll just do that again. <laughs> curse the Doggo. Start defending. I'm not as fussed by the Bolt Hunt. Like, the Bolt Hunt is, yeah, it's strong and it's fast, but I can get it, at least. I can hurt the thing. I can hurt the darn thing. There you go. Hello, Yoghurt. Um, heal here. Jam Mask. Then 
Jamal's could do a curse on the next turn. And Doggo is cursed, the Doggo dies from the curse. Well, Impy Dimp is sitting there, sucker punching it if it tries to hit Impy Dimp as well. Or, um, fucking whatever it's called. Rundy Imp C, of course, yeah. I think I got this. I think I might just about have this one as well. Let's see. Um, curse. Oh, fuck, he's got crunch! Don't kill me. Yes, good. And I take away strong jaws. So you can't even bite me good anymore. Good. I got rid of your good bites. Haha, <laughs> take that, doggo. Y'all can't bite me good anymore. No, dead. Alright, and then back to Bolt turned. And run D Impsy. Alright, I'm gonna come at you with a sucker punch. Slap you if you try to attack me. Which you are going to do. Big hits. Now you have the ability to look at my items if that's gonna help you. Yep, I'm wearing a muscle band. I take the spark. I don't die from the spark. You die from curse! And if you don't die from curse, then I'll get you with the next sucker punch. As soon as you try to attack me, you're gonna lose. Sucker punch. If you dare try to hit me, you're going down. Got ya. Got the doggo. And that is Hop defeated. Alright, he's actually full on rival now in terms of his skill level. This is rubbish! Got him. Yeah! Look at that! Echo! Reaching your final form! <clears throat> look at him! He's so glorious, Corviknight! Oh, hell yeah! Nice. That is our Corviknight! A black luster could drive terror into the heart of any foe. Flying and steel! Ooh, good combo. He's got his fucking armor on now. Steel wing, yes. It's like Skarmory, but in my eyes, better. <laughs> he just looks way cooler. Um, let's swap out. You know what? I've been having so much fun with it, but I'm going to swap out Power Trip. I think Steel Wing's going to be far more devastating in the long run. A mighty knight to serve a mighty king. That's our Corviknight. Alright. I can tell how strong my brother is. But I'm getting stronger too. That you are. Legit though. <laughs> Alrighty. You have fun with that hop. I'll see you in Surchester. Now, are my Pokemon done with their jobs? I think I might have gone through, I might be down to my last few Pokemon that I just want to level up and evolve before I can go back to my good team. <laughs> before I go to a good constructed team that I can like beat the game with. With the occasional swap out for an occasional Pokemon that might pop up. Pokejobs. New Pokejobs available. That's fine. Alright. Oh, one hour left. Darn it. 30 minutes left, alright. 30 more minutes. You know what I can, do, I can do though? I can actually order that curry that I was going to order. Let me order that curry. I didn't get around to doing that, I said I would do it ages ago. While we were talking about curry and such, so... We're going to just eat and see if I can very quickly order myself just a fucking spicy madras or something. Before it closes. Before the place closes. That's just going to cycle while I do it and make a little progress. So I'm not just standing still like a lemon. There we are. Oh, why has I got the wrong postcode in here? That's not right. My actual postcode and address is... No, I'm not going <laughs> to say it out loud on a stream. There we are. This is where I live, Internet. I'm doxing myself. Haha. -ha. Consider myself doxed. Oh, yeah, it's renamed Polka as well. Let's do that while we're here. Okay. I look up my past orders and redo an order. Just order the thing I ordered again. 
Because you know I want that good shit again. It was good before and it'll be good again. Alright, uh, da 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 da. Uh, name rater. Sorry, I'm kind of playing with one hand. <laughs> Alright. Uh, rate nickname. There we go. I'm going to change it to Strife. Select. Yep, Polka. It's now going to become Strife. There we are. All cap. Not all caps. There we go. S T R I F E. Do we have money for fashion? Ooh, good question. Very good question. I'll have to look into that. Let me quickly just make sure this order goes through. I think it's there. I think I got the order down. Yep, problem address with the tango. Delivery, yes. Check out. Paper card. Please, I want my curry. I need my good dinner. I have not eaten any food today other than a cherry pie. <laughs> a cherry pie and two pork pies. And the pork pies were tiny also. They were very small pork pies. There we go. Yeah, food's pretty important. <laughs> Alright. I've just been so devoted to this damn game. <laughs> there we are. Uh, what is my security number? That's what it is. Nice. Order placed, and that's on its way. Hooray for the simplicity of doing shit on the internet. <clears throat> Alright. Oh yeah, fashion. Let's do a little fashion. Let's see what the fashion shop has for us. I'm pretty sure this fashion ha shop didn't have any pants, but I'll check. <clears throat> yes! And all I need now, all I need, yes! Uri! <laughs> Jotaro! All right, good. I've done it, I did it, I did it. Black shoes, no, they're gold shoes, they're like gold shoes. Golden shoes, that's the goldest I can get, there we are. <laughs> okay, this is all I, this is, I needed this to take a break from those hard battles. Good. On oh, the rucksack, what do I do with the rucksack? I gotta do something with the rucksack. Um, I'll, just put, I'll just put that on, it's something different, there we go. It's not the rucksack I care about necessarily, it's more everything else that I care about right now. There we go, I can't, I can't have gloves on, I'll cover my powerful nails. Yes, I'm done with shopping. Alright, good. Now, if I go to my card, my league card, is there a way of me to retake that and get it perfect? I just need to redo that, just get it right there. Um, flip card. There's definitely a way, I, somewhere I can go to where I can update the card. If not, I'm just going to have to go to the makeover place again. Do old Joseph? Ooh, that could be fun too. That could be very fun. Alright, town map. We go back to the place I was at and I'm just going to go... I don't know how else to uh, interact with the card thing, so I'm just going to go and uh, do it this way. Flying taxi, yes please. Yeah, I'm just going to go to the makeup place and just ask if they could just do the card there for me. Oh shit, where am I? Um... It's Motoslake I want to be at, right? No, it's not Motoslake, is it? Motoslake's the other place. I mixed up my places. I want to go to up here. There we are. Hammerlock. The other main big hub world place. Alright, cool. Here we are back in Hammerlock. I'm definitely looking the part now. I just need it on my trainer card and then I'm perfect. Nice. What'd you like to do today? Makeup. Yeah, I'll pay a thousand pounds for you to not do anything, just to update my card, sure. Confirm. This is all good. No, this is fine. Let's get cracking. Good. All done. Thank you for the patience. Now let's reprint the card. Alright, let's take it in. Let's take in the glory. 
Yes! <laughs> oh, there he is. Dio fucking Brando. Perfect. That's me. <laughs> David. <laughs> I'm ready to continue the adventure now. I've had my fun. I've had my fashion fun. When the curry gets here, I'll have another little breather. I don't see why we can't have a little power and a chat while I'm eating my curry there. Like I say, I'm really not tired. I don't really feel like going to bed, so... I might as well just keep this thing going until I'm, uh, actually tired. For anyone watching this on YouTube as a VOD? Yeah, I've done all of this in one sitting, yo. <laughs> all of this in one goddamn sitting. I might be the whole damn game in a sitting. Because sleep is for the week. <laughs> Here we are. Hello, over here. Oh, what'd this be? <gasps> oh, it's another... It's. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's fucking dope, but I've already got a Viking Meowth. I've already got my good, uh... Yeah, I've already got that good Mon. Hello! Yeah, I'm running on hype, pretty much. Oh, God, I look so good! Raybombi! Cutest goddamn Pokemon ever. Run DMC! I look fucking dope as hell! Here we go. Um, let's pull out Dumbo. Dumbo hasn't actually got any good, like, steel attacks, which is wild. So, Echo. Let's go for Echo. I'll stick with Echo for this so I can use my steel wings to deal with this bug. Or my, um, draw pecs. That works too. What up? What are you going to do against this big fucker, eh? Don't think there's much you can do in the face of this. Pidgeot, go fuck yourself. I'm better than you. Drill peck. I don't care if you are in your mega form, Pidgeot. You ain't got shit on this big fucking steel bird. Drill pick. Nice. Lovely. Good XP. Run D Imp C. Level 37. Oh, Vespaquen as well. Wow. Good mons. Interesting mons. It's a ship. Corvenite's just so fucking powerful that I'm gonna. Lay waste to you. Drill peck. God damn. Love it. Dumbo's level 34. And that is Mila. Lovely. And elephants evolving. Good. And I'm pretty sure this thing's evolved form is its final form because it's fucking huge. So, there we go. Fucking, uh, Copperaja. Hey, Copperaja. Uh, they came over from another region long ago. Please tell me we get a Pokemon game set in India. Yes, please. And they work together with humans. Their green skin is resistant to water. It is a Copperderm. Great. <laughs> Great. Lovely. And it wants to learn Heavy Slam. That works for me. Uh, I was literally just commenting on how you don't have a good Steel type move to attack with, and now you do! One, two, poof. Or oh, ta-da. Heavy Slam time. <clears throat> oh, God, you're so persistent! Dang little Viking, go away! Ah! Alright. Got some good shit there. Any new Pokemon in this route? Anything I haven't caught before? Oh, hello, what is that? It is a... Oh, it's a Meow Stick! Hey, Meow Stick! Cool, well, you're gonna get very, very killed very, very quickly by False Surrender. Oh, hello, stealing my ability, are ya? Don't know what you're gonna do with that. You're gonna look at my item, good for you. You have fun with that. Now I'm going to stab you with my good hair. Bleh. And a sucker punch for good measure. Oh, you're not even attacking me. Alright. No sucker punch then. Um, keep sucker punching until you hit me. Are you going to hit me? Or are you just going to sit there defending yourself? I wonder. I'd be very curious if that's your strategy is to just keep defending. Ah, there we go. The fuck? 
You suck a punch on me? That's so rude! I got confused there, I didn't know what was happening! Alright, I'm stabbing you with my hair again. Bleh. Wow, this is a very Dio-esque Pokemon I'm using also. Right down to the little hand, uh, the hand waggle. It's like, yes, everything that's happened, everything that has transpired has been part of my grand plan. Alright. Yeah, swap out Ellie, friend. Uh, Seth, how much longer now, since we had a little Dio bit of Dio fun? How much longer till I can get my Pokemon back from their jobs? I wonder. <clears throat> Those good Jojo fingers. This is definitely that with the job system, I feel like definitely rewards players who are playing the game at a slower pace and are taking their time getting through it. But because I'm blitzing through it in one, the job thing is just kind of irritating. I'm getting in the way. Oh, is it done? It's completed! Yeah! Let's get those mons back. They all need to be leveled up too. Hello, guys. How much did you all level up by? Job completed. They did a good job, and they got experience points. That's also that's so little for all of them! God, the jobs are kind of useless, eh? Am I, am I crazy on that one? Or are the jobs kind of rubbish? Like, maybe they're designed for when you're playing in the long term, and you like, you're leaving them there for days. Like, yeah. Oh well, I ain't gonna bother with the jobs for the rest of this. They're not particularly helpful for me. So, let's swap out Dumbo with... Carcool? There we are. Or Coltrane, sorry. Put you there. And these mons all need to be evolved as well. Um, can anyone look up this Stunfisk for me? Just look up Galar Stunfisk and let me know if it does evolve. If not, it's also going in the box. <laughs> yeah. I got my buds back. That's the main thing. That's good. Here we are. Cause like I say, when all those buddies back in the party and leveling those guys up and all that shit, it's gonna be uh... I'm, eventually I'm gonna get to the point where I've like, you know, leveled up and evolved all the Galar Pokemon that I needed to level up and evolve, so yeah. Fucking just fanboying out, are ya? Okay, cool. Let me fight this pilot looking dude. Oh, a taxi driver. Okay, cool. I hope he doesn't go on a long uh, tirade about them immigrants while I battle him. That would be unfortunate. Corvusquire! Oh, you still have a Corvusquire? Ha! That's cute. Motherfucker. Alright, um... I'll come at you with... Tundra Wave? I guess I'm not gonna come at you with Tundra Wave. Fuck the Tundra Wave, that's not part of the plan anymore. Not doing that. Instead, I'm just going to surrender at you. Please do not hurt me. I am but a poor little imp boy. Please do not harm me. It does not evolve. Oh, it doesn't. Okay, good. Well, put that in the box and never see the fucker again. Oh, fuck, I should have used the um, sucker punch there. Wasn't paying attention. Full surrender. Cool. Done. There's that. Eventually I'm going to overcome the hurdle where everything has evolved and everything just evolves immediately when I get into battle and then I can just use the mons that I intend to use. Uh, false Surrender. Take that, you dang little bird! Ow. Piss. Piss and biscuits. Alright, uh, next up we have... Coal train, baby! Let's get the coal train back in. I've missed the coal train. It's been too long, coal train. have been in there far too long. But I've spent far too long doing your dang job for 100 odd experience points. Pissy bollocks. Alright, here we go. Smack down. Just bring it. There we are. Nice. And that is Cabby Bruce! No matter where I go in my taxi, loss and loneliness follow. Well, that's just genuinely upsetting. Uh-oh. Oh dear. I can't even make fun of that. <laughs> it's just genuinely sad. My favourite Pokemon is just bumming around this place, hooray! What up, Galvantulas? 
Oh, shake one more time. There we go, berries. That'll do. Quit. Berries acquired. Any more Pokemon here that are new? Nope, okay, cool. Alright, back onto Route 8. Hmm. What we got down here? Oh, got Togedemaru. Hello, Togedemaru. Who's this in here? Oh, it's a Bronzong! Hiding! So stealthily! This big fuck off bastards. Alright, well. Oh yeah, I love them spooders. They're very good spooders. Uh, I'm gonna leave this battle. No thank you. Do not want. Any more Pokemon here that are new? Anything I'm not caught before? Not that I can see. Let's go. Hello. I will closely examine the health of your Pokemon, but not offer any healing or anything. Like they did in goddamn Unova. Did that in Unova? If you killed a doctor, it'd heal ya. Stingy doctors here. Anyway. It's the opposite of that, actually. It's over here. Doctors will treat you, even if you don't have money. Anyway. Um, Roselia. Get the cool train to run over Roselia. There we are. Nice. I missed his face as well. He's got such a good face. That face just looks so goddamn... That face looks like... It reminds me of... There's this game for the Sega Mega Drive or Genesis and it starred a pencil. And it was like a pencil but he was an edgy mascot. He's like, he's like a super edgy mascot trying to be like super cool like Sonic the Hedgehog. And he had a really weird fucked up face. And Coltrane's face reminds me of that character's face. And I know that's the most obscure goddamn pull and that wasn't much to go on. But damn it, that's what it reminds me of. So much though. Uh, I wonder if that flame charge was enough for me to overtake Roselia. Let's find out. It was. Get dunked on. Get Coltrane. Nice. That's you done. Level up. Level up. And next up is Hatrim. Hope it becomes a train. I would love a Pokemon to represent Network Rail or British Rail. That would be great. <laughs> I'd love that. Alright, next up we have... Hatrim, who's Psychic and Fairy. So let's come at that with Corviknight. Sounds about right. <laughs> Just wreck your face with my big angry burb. Hello. Hello again, motherfucker. Oh, you're calming your mind, are ya? Alright, that'll definitely help against uh, the thing I'm about to do to you. Where I smash you in the face with a giant wing made out of pure steel. And boom! Ooh, I wasn't super effective. Huh, okay. Must just be Psychic type then. Here I thought it was Fairy as well. Oh well. Maybe when it evolves it becomes Psychic and Fairy. It seems very Fairy-like. Bam. Dead. Done. Cool. There's a the level ups. More level ups. And that's Dr. Joanna. Alrighty, so upstairs we go. Go right past fucking Gerda here. Everyone's favourite Pokemon, Gerda. And yes, it is D U R R in Gerda. Miss Maggie, Miss Magius's pastel cousin. Yeah, fuck yeah. Works for me. Oh, look at that thing down there. I want to find out what that little thing down there is. Oh, okay, walking with his little feet. It's like a wiggler, a little bit. Oh, I think that was me. I think that was for me. Let me go get my curry. Prawn Madras acquired. Hooray! <clears throat> Alright. Cool. 
so, uh, where am I? Where was I? I'll let that cool down for a little bit before I eat any of it. Um, I've lost now. I'm lost now. Whoops. <laughs> See, down here, up here. That's where I was just now. Oh, item. Next defenses, cool. Go away, bird. Fuck off, bird. <laughs> Bloody rufflet. Alright, well. Should I run or should I stay? Uh, I'm gonna run. Okay, so, I'm gonna go down this way, see what's down this way as well. Another Pokeball. Shiny Stone. Makes certain species of Pokemon evolve. I don't know which species though. Don't know if any of the Pokemon I have evolved with Shiny Stones, so... Nope, good, cool. Oh, I'm also gonna give Strawberry Sweet back to uh, Yoghurt. There we are. Lovely. Cool. I'm right back down this way. Upstairs. Get some nice quality sauce for the veggies in the fridge. Oh, that would be good. I'm sure that would be amazing. That sounds like a fun time. Oh, hello. Pokeball. Hyper potions. Thank you. Up the stairs. This is a very stair heavy route. <laughs> Here's something the older games couldn't possibly have actually quite like done for you. Couldn't do this in the older Pokemon games, just a route full of stairs. Ah, oh, hello, Drapion. God damn that thing. Imagine that thing just jumping out at you in like a fucking dark alley at night time. Ugh. No thank you. I can't even run away from it. Oh, that's that's not horror fuel at all. Not at all nightmarish. I can't escape this thing. I guess I'd better stay and fight it. Let's knock off the bastard, see if he's got any items, get rid of him. Hmm, well... Any items on you? Nope, no items, well... Um, back to Echo. There we are. Nice. No matter how scary you seem, your fucking big angry burb always wins it. Stop pin missling me. <laughs> Stop that. Please. Thank you. Alright, drill peck. So, I hope you all are enjoying the stream so far. <laughs> this is a really goddamn long one. This is the longest stream I've ever done. Well, longest solo stream I've ever done. Obviously, right to hell. Right to hell went as long as this. Maybe not even. I think right to hell might have gone on longer. I don't know, huh. Either way, this is a fucking long ass stream, and I'm still having fun with it, because this game is... Just, it's still amazing to me that this game was the, like, the catalyst for so much fucked up controversy and so many people getting so angry about it, and it's like, this is a great game! Y'all are looking for stuff to get mad about, like, wow. It's kind of incredible. But the game itself is like, I think this is the best Pokemon game. There are a few Pokemon games that I would sit down and like, be willing to invest as much time into as this. So, yeah. But it's just so like, large and expansive and it's so like... And it's not large and expansive in a way where it's all just empty and dead. There's, it's just content fucking everywhere. There's so many choices, there are so many enemies at any given place at any given time. What is this, friends? Phalanx! I love Phalanx! <laughs> wow! I love this guy! This is so good! Alright, um, I'll go at you with some... Um, definitely Steel type. So, I'm gonna go for a Rock Smash. I think it's Steel and Bug. It looks very Steel and Bug. They're, they're like little, little Romans, they're a little shield wall. A bunch of little Roman shield wall fighters. And they have reversal, so I need to be careful. If I get it at low health, which is where I want it to be to catch it, it's going to be able to hurt me harder. So, knock off. Oh, can I can use Rock Smash now, because Choice Scarf, yeah. Uh, I'm glad, oh, oh, thank you, oh, thank you very much, I appreciate how much you, uh, you care for my uh, enjoyment, I guess. No retreat. 
What the fuck? Is this my new favorite Pokemon? Because what the hell? What was that move? You just... Oh, it just makes it always stronger, but it cannot retreat? That's a great ability! That's so good! Like, yeah, I guess in competitive matches it can fuck you over, because then you can swap for something that beats them, and they can't leave. But they're so much stronger now. Damn, I like Phalanx a lot. Phalanx is a good set of Pokemon. I also like that this is one Pokemon, but it's a hive mind. It's a bunch of them. Like, yeah, we have stuff like Diglett and Magneton, which is basically that, but not on this scale. Not a bunch of them. Uh, I'm trying the Heavy Ball. It does look like a Mario enemy, yeah. Let's try my Heavy Ball on them. Are they heavy together? United. Banded together. No, they're not. They're quite light. First impression won't work because this battle's been going for a while now. That only works at the beginning of a battle. Great ball. It is a Mecha Wiggler, yeah. That's kind of what this feels like. And oh, they are not taking well to being captured though. That's going to be my issue now. Is dealing with that. And that issue. I have a funny feeling Phalanx doesn't evolve as well, just looking at them. I can't imagine an evolved form of something that already is so many different creatures banding together. Unless they become like one big powerful unit, I don't know. Like, yeah. Anyway. Uh, there's not much more I can do without risking killing you. I don't want to do that, so... Balls it is. And I love these guys so much that I won't even be annoyed if their catch rate is high. Because they're just so cool. There's just so many of them as well. Like, if I catch all of these in a Pokeball, like, damn. Good. I uh, tried Dusk Ball. It's not particularly dark out, but... Something different. Sometimes I get good luck with worse Pokeballs. Nah, never mind. Alright, this thing's spamming first impression now, so I have a funny feeling it can't hurt my ghost. So that's good. That is good. That is very good. Nah, oh, damn, they are just fucking... Oh, if they form together like in a Sentai kind of way? Yes! Best Pokemon then. Just the best one. Well done, you did it. You became, you've made the best Pokemon. And it's a platoon of little guys stamping around with their little armors on. Let's see, um, oh, is a Hex going to kill them? If a Hex kills them, at least I can come back to this route later. Let's see. Wow, Hex nowhere near kills them. That's good, I could use another Hex, in fact. Two Hexes to get you to low health. Good. Perfect. Alright. Great balls. Don't do me dirty now. Don't do me dirty. I need this little guy. I need these little guys, plural. Well, all I'm doing right now is just mashing the catch button, so I might as well just uh, eat my curry while I do this. Might as well just enjoy myself. Don't want to get. I don't want to get salty at these guys. I love them too much. So hey, pop arms first of all. There we are. Dip that right into the curry sauce. Mm. This shit is the best. Good choices were made today. Not universally, but good choices in general. I made quite a few bad choices in this LP, admittedly. Bip, bip, bip. Yeah! Oh, wow, I didn't even get through the whole goddamn Poppadom. Alright. Nailed it. Mm-hmm. Alright, I kind of have to learn about these guys. What are they? They are fighting type. That five of them are troopers, one is the brass. The brass's orders are absolute. What a fucking fantastic Pokemon. A formation Pokemon. What do we call these guys? What do we call this squad of absolute fucking units? Who make a squad that is an absolute fucking unit. I'll let you decide. I'll let you come up with a name while I munch. Platoon? Okay. 
Got Platoon down. Legion! Legion is good. Legion's good because it... Legion gives me a feeling of like, a hive mind. We are Legion. We cannot be stopped. We cannot be reasoned with. There we go. Mmm. Oh, it's so good. Mmm. Legion it is. You're going to the box, Legion. Can anyone look up to see if Legion evolves? Uh, Phalanx. F-A-L-I-N-K-S. Actually, you might not need to. Pokedex may confirm it for me. Let me see. Let me check first. I'll get you to do all the work all the goddamn time. I don't want you guys getting spoiled on things either. I'd rather you find out along with me. If I can help it. Where Phalanx at? <clears throat> Phalanx. Ah, there's Phalanx. Oh, I don't know. Don't know if it evolves or not. Hmm. Oh, Geordies is in, like, Newcastle. That's spelled G-E-O-R-D-I-E-S, but... I guess you could have Jordan. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah. Does Phalanx, uh, evolve into anything? It would be weird if they did, because that move seems so specific. Yeah, if you could Google it. Because that move seems so specific. The one where they just, like, stood on the little island together and all that, like, huh. It doesn't seem like a move that just anyone could do. Unless, like, it has an evolved form, and that form also has, like, an alternate animation for that ability. There we go. I'll let you Google that. Will I continue to munch? Anyway, there's something so nice about just fucking having a big pot of curry sauce and then just dipping what the hell ever into it. It does not evolve. Do you know why? Because it's already perfect. I understand. That's fine. We are Legion. We are Phalanx. And curry is getting postponed. There we are. I'm going to beat this route and then I'll sit down and properly commit to eating. There's a thunderstorm in the wild area. Good for it. <clears throat> That's probably going to give us, like, thunderous or something, but I am good right now. Rhyhorn! Rhyhorn! Yep, nice. What up here, my jam mask? Um, Ain't got shit for a Rhyhorn. Bye! Bye! Alright, you done? Pixel play. If I had an Arceus, I could turn it into a fairy type. I don't have an Arceus. Don't even know if Arceus is in this. Cool. Oh, fucking Gerda. Who wants Gerda? No one wants Gerda. I think it's horrible clown nose. There goes Gerda. There goes me, away from Gerda. Running, ideally. Oh, fucking again? He heard what I said about his horrible clown nose and he had to get revenge. Alright, well. Um, no, I'm not even in a good enough state to beat him up. <laughs> nope. Oh yeah, please do pet the pet pet the pets for us. Pet the puppers. And here we go, next battle. Backpacker Barbara. <clears throat> Sending out Dreepy! Oh, I love Dreepy. It's a spooky dragon! It's a ghost dragon! It's so Dreepy! It's a dragon who is creepy. That's adorable as fuck. Uh, get hexed. You're a ghost, therefore you're bad against hexes. But I'm also bad against- I'm bad against getting astonished, so fuck. Oh, hello. Let me steal your ability there, thank you. Alright, you're just gonna keep doing that or are you gonna Okay bye, that's fine. I'll take a bite. Oh my god, that flinched me too! Stop flinching me! 
I swear to God. That's some bullshit if you're going to keep doing that. There we are. Hex. There we go. That's what I was hoping for. Something quick, decisive, and powerful. Nice. Next up is Vullaby. Hello, Burb. Hello, Skull Pants Burb. How are you and your Skull Pants to doing today? Makes the Pokemon look real small. Yeah. <laughs> I appreciate that. I, I like seeing a small Pokemon being small and adorable. Although Waylord is in it and Waylord in this and he looks tiny when he appears in battle and that's kind of funny to me. It looks very silly seeing Waylord be tiny. But then again, seeing Waylord in his actual size also looks ridiculous. Waylord just needs to be made to be like as big as the game can reasonably make him without fucking the camera up. But then also not looking ridiculous like in Pokemon Battle Revolution. Where if you had four Waylords, your screen was just blue. It was just a big blue mess. Because you had four blue whales covering all of the potential space where Pokemon could be. Anyway. I'll just write it up in the camera's grill. Crafty Shield. Why am I using Crafty Shield? Why the fuck am I doing that for? What am I even thinking? I'm literally just going brain autopilot. Might be the curry distracting me. Um, I need to swap you out. Let's swap you to Yoghurt. Here comes Yoghurt. Get you in there, get you to do a good kiss. And who, who knows, eventually I might even figure out how to make you evolve. Maybe. Possibly. Hopefully. I've given you the strawberry now. I feel like the strawberry and the fucking level is high enough. I feel like you should be there. I feel like you should be ready to evolve by now. <clears throat> there we are. I mean, Al Creamy's not a spoiler, we've met Al Creamy, so if you could also check out Creamy for me, sorry to give you more workload. Double check to see if Al Creamy can, uh, if there's a way of evolving or if it's just leveling up. Hmm. Waylord should have been double the size of an orca. Yeah, it is, I mean, it is a blue whale, though. It is just a blue whale, and it's a very big ass blue whale, so... I mean, blue whales are ridiculously large. They are hilariously large animals in real life. So yeah. Oh my god, this guy. Fuck this guy though. I can't with this guy. Mmm, mmm, musician. Oh my god, has he got fucking golden grills? And he's fucking rapping? Oh yes. Oh, I keep finding better and better NPCs in this game. It's like the. They just take the bar and then they just. This bar just goes higher and higher each time. Wow. Check this motherfucker out. This guy just fucking owning this shit. And now I've got your horrible iron barbs. If you hit me, you're gonna get injured. Sucks to be you. More hexes. There we are. It also, by the way, it was like it took me ages to realize that when you were saying Poggles, you're referring to Pokemon. I was like, oh, what? Oh, okay. That's a nice, charming name you have for them, Poggles. <clears throat> no, NPCs have been repeating, but usually they're like, there are only like one or two of them that are like identical in like in a given area. There's enough variation of them that you don't notice the repeats. But there are, there are, you know, NPCs that are the same. I feel like there needs to be, to an extent. Not every trainer you fight has to be unique. That would be a lot. That would be, that'd be crazy. Hex. Especially because the whole idea is that they're just fitting into archetypes, so yeah. Alright. There goes Togedemaru. And there goes Charles. <laughs> that was nice, though. Alright, I like that this character is actually designed to be look goofy and act kind of goofy. That's that's cute. I respect that. Hello, hello Crossle. There's something great about how your big rocky back just popped up out of nowhere. Whoop! Hello, I am Rock. I am moving Rock. Do not mind me, I'm simply Rock. 
Oh, speaking of rock, there's a king's rock. Thank you. There's a nugget. Also, thank you. Oh, fucking hell. See you guys again. I'm sorry. I wasn't ready for Legion. I wasn't prepared this time. <laughs> ah, run. Run from Legion. Alright, there we go. Upstairs, and I think we're near the end now. I think we might have reached the end of this route. Yep, there we are. Woo, that one. That was an interesting designed route. And there's people around there, wow. I'm gonna go up and heal first before I engage in any more people. Go up, heal, sort my team, reorganize my team. Uh, oh wow, snow. Now we're in the snow zone. Huh, okay. But I think, ah, oh, yeah, there we go. We got, shh, we got a healing up here. Good. Nice. Alrighty. Ice gym, ice city. How oh, lovely. And the music is goddamn beautiful. I'm gonna have to leave this Pokemon Center and just let us enjoy the nice music while I eat my dinner. I think that might be a good call. And then we could continue. Yeah, we're now in Canada. My favorite part of England. Um, all right, here we go. So you can actually go into the box number two because you don't evolve. Ability is mimicry. I actually want to see what that is before anything. What does that do? Uh, changes your type depending on terrain. Oh, that's cool, I guess. Alright. Anyway, um... We'll lesion, if I can get you guys in that box as well. With your good-ass battle armor and good shit. Uh, yep. Cool. Uh, next up we've got... Vlob, we've got Snonk! So I might... Swap out... Famous last words! Echo! For Vlob. My strong... Excuse me, my strongest Pokemon for the weakest one I got. Or the lowest level, the highest level for the lowest level. Alright, I'm setting myself back a little bit now. Or I'm setting myself back a lot, but... Fuck, it'll be worth it though when it all comes together. If it all comes together. Alrighty, Sue. So, there we are. Let's heal up. Take the mons, thank you. Nice. There we are. Alright, out we go. We're going to get us into the nice snowy drifts. Lovely. And I'll tell you what, I'm just going to leave you this nice peaceful music for a while while I have a bit of food. So, be right back. You know what? When I order a curry, sometimes the guy on the phone just likes to ask like, Ah, so you're having a, I don't know, like a prawn madras. Uh, would you like rice or naan with that? And I always think that question is so goddamn wild, because it's just like, Yes! Yes to all of the above! How? I can't fathom having a curry without both of those things. Because the rice you need with the curry, because it kind of bulks it out and it gives it more like, viscosity and there's like more flavor to it and also good for carbs as well and uh, yeah and then the naan is perfect as a counterpart with the curry and rice together because it can scoop them all up and turn it into a neat little sandwich package so always yes to both to clarify I'm still eating but <laughs> I just wanted to get that point out of my head before like it drives me up the wall so yeah and uh, I'm loving the idea of princess giving Angry microwave ambience. I'm so sorry for standing near that goddamn fucking coal car. I didn't realise that the car coal. I didn't realise the car coal there would just keep fucking making noises. That is my bad. Let me move away from car coal. Let me go slightly nicer. There we are. That's better. It's less now. Hmm. A couple of big bites and I'll be done anyway.
singing in the snow. Fuck yeah. The fuck? Oh. The fuck? What? <laughs> oh shit! I did that as a joke! That's what it fucking meant! And when you give it a strawberry and you spin with it! You have to spin with it! I'm assuming after a certain level, but fuck! I entirely did that by accident. I'm not joking, that wasn't me knowing that. Holy shit. Fuck yeah. Uh, the thing said, if you if you give it the strawberry thing, they will spin in happiness. So I gave it the thing, I gave it the strawberry, it's at a high enough level, probably high enough friendship. I spun, and now it evolved. That's dope. That's so fucking good. Wow. <coughs> I've still got food in my mouth. <laughs> Alright, and that is the Ruby Swell variant. The moment it evolved, it took, it took on mixed flavour. It sells spontaneously shifted during evolution. I like that it's fully evolved. And it's also one foot tall. And it's like 1.1 1, 1. 1 pounds heavy. It's still fucking tiny and adorable. Hell yes. Decorate? Uh, what the hell is decorate? Gotta know. Gotta know this one. Decorate does... Sharply raises your uh, your targets, attack, and special. That's great. In a double battle, though, you can buff your opponents. You can buff your allies' attack. Fuck me. Hmm. I'm gonna get rid of fucking dazzling gleam for that. Cause yeah, I'm not necessarily gonna do any double battles, but I might do later with this thing. If it can do that. Hmm. Thank you, Yoghurt. I guess that's a new Pokemon for me to burn the box. I did that so fucking... Oh my god, that's wild. After doing that goof so many times, I had no idea. Well. Hmm. That's rad. Um, let's change my Pokemon round. Right, Yoghurt. Let's take your item off of you. If you eat part of it, does it grow back? I hope so. I hope it's somewhat regenerative. I mean, it, most of its movesets are inherently regenerative. So I feel like you could never truly kill it by eating it. I feel like it would just, like... It would just reform itself. And probably do more damage to you than you do to it. Also, there's also that worry. you got to be careful of that, too. I'm about to sneeze. I'm about... No, I'm not about to sneeze. I am about to sneeze. Oh, fucking hell. Everything's happening right now. Here I was thinking I was just going to finish my bowl of curry and then like 20 goddamn things happened. Oh, I just can't leave well enough alone, can I? Alright, um, kiss, get back in the party. There we are. Now, curry. I'm going to sit down and actually commit to eating this curry now. Done. Good. Let us continue with adventures. Oh, God. Oh, that was some spice. Hmm. Look at this doopy ass snowman. <laughs> that doopy ass snowman, though. <clears throat> okay, um. Well, keep an eye on the town. This is a nice place. I rather fancy catching a vanillish. Catching Pokemon is a young man's game. If you eat what? Oh, if you eat, um. Al creamy, yeah. Finish for throw? No, thank you. Bad deal. <clears throat> Is there such thing as a snowman Pokemon? I feel like you're hinting. What the hell, dee dee dee? The hell is that? And why is it so adorable? That little snow slug? That little snow bug? It looks like, like, Shigechi's head, or like Lisa Simpson's hair or something. But with little cute bugs sticking out of it. Anyway. <coughs> there we are. Let's, uh... I'm not going to take on the ice gym yet. 
my team's not there because most of it is brand new and has just been dragged out of the workhouses. So instead, I am going to go back and deal with those trainers that were in that last area. Ah, snowman! <gasps> oh, oh, that is a Galarian version of that fucking one monkey Pokemon. And it's a snowy version of it. What's it called? Fuck. Um, Darmanitan. Uh, Darumaka. Darumaka and Darmanitan. That is a snowy Darumaka. Making sure not to say Dakimaka, because that's a different thing entirely. Hello. I will be your training partner. Thank you, officer. Ah! Thank you, Bobby. Officer Bobby. Wow. I'm gonna fight you! I'll get on! Oh, you missed my dope Arcanine shirt, you fool. You know, technically, I could still wear the Arcanine shirt. I could still keep the Dio jacket and the rest of the Dio aesthetic. Anyway, um... Let's go for a, uh... Yeah, no, it's an untru- it's a terrifying smile. Deeply haunting smile, at the very least. Uh, I'm gonna change to someone who can tank an Arcanine. And return its attacks back tenfold. Coltrane! You know, we've already seen body pillows, we've seen our share of those. Or body, body pillow cases, at the very least. <clears throat> oh, zip! Zip zap! And buffeted. Alrighty, well, I'm gonna smack you down, doggo. Prepare to get smacked down. Smacked down. Yeah, I'm good at words. I'm good at words today. Boof. And, uh... Ooh, where's this one going? It's not going in my favour at the very least. I know that much. So... Yeah, I'm low on healing items as well. I'm going to swap you out, Coltrane. I'm going to hop back into Jam Mask. There we are. <clears throat> oh, they were like, they were, they were just banners with her face on. But I, I thought it was funny to imagine that they're just body pillow cases. <laughs> Whatever they are, I'm sure that they're being used for the same nefarious purposes. Time for Hex. <clears throat> Let's Hex this doggo. Oh, fucking hell. Raw? Really? Okay. Who next? Okay, Kiss. Well, Kiss ain't gonna do shit, Kiss is level 22. What do you think Kiss is gonna do right now? Other than get bodies. With its mere 66 HP, given everything. Yeah, I'm gonna swap you out. Um, I'm going back to Jam Mask again. Me? Wholesome? Oh, thank you. I'm very wholesome. There's nothing unwholesome about body pillows. They're comfortable. <laughs> Sometimes it's nice to have a pillow that you can lie on with your whole body. Like a mattress, but just a pillow. <laughs> and also there's an anime on it. Anyway. God damn, Arcanine! Don't you dare pull out Kiss again after that. Alright. Run the Impsy, he's got this. In fact, he has, doesn't have to have anything, because the, the hail just killed Arcanine. Cool. <clears throat> okay, Arcanine just... I'm surprised the game's not confused with, like, how much switching just happened there, about how much experience everyone gets. Oh, Blob gets a lot, though. Boop, 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 boop. Fucking hell. There we are. I'm, there are, I'm sure there are many cute and non-sexy body pillows out there. I haven't looked into them, I'm not particularly interested, but I probably should be, because like, I sleep on a couch, so my back's kind of fucked, and I could do with more pillow. I could do with more support. Anyway, um... I'm gonna swap Hex with Shadow Ball, because that's way stronger. There are absolutely non-horny body pillows. Dope. Okay. Oh, more level ups. Kiss is also learning rest. No, thank you. And Boltoned! Oh, wow. Dang it. 
Here are your police dogs. What a good boy. Alright, false surrender. Use I like that you're using your uh I like that he's using his, you know, he's a cop and he's going against my evil fucking imp. My little criminal of a Pokemon. The ultimate folly for a police officer is a criminal Pokemon. Wait, why what? I didn't do anything, I didn't say anything. I just said that my Pokemon is a criminal. Oh, you mean attacking me? I gotta win the battle, it is Pokemon. I can't not, I can't just get bodied. I'm not just gonna let myself get bodied because the dog is cute. I can't do that. Otherwise, this game doesn't get beaten. I'm sorry. If it's any consolation, it's a cop's dog. It's a narc. Oh, you mean my sleeping, my back. Alright, well, yeah. I'll see if I can get a cheap pet somewhere, maybe. He's a cop. Yeah, yeah, that's for the beating of the Pokemon. Oh, yeah, that's fine. No remorse there. Look at Sneasel fucking running, dash, dashing towards me. Fucking claws at the ready. Ready to fuck me up. No, thank you, Sneasel. Not cool. No, fuck off! Oh, and then it just shadow... It just fucking... Naruto ran towards me, and then it just fucking shadow bobbed away. Smoke bomb, that's what I'm looking for. Okay, well... Hello, people. Hello, rich people. Rich business people. Someone's using the non-sexy body pillar in an inappropriate way. JC, I hate to spoil your fun, but people are using everything in inappropriate ways. Everything's fuckable if you try hard enough. I'm sure people will be able to tell you that. So, you know. Fucking say lovey. <laughs> Anyway, here we go. Let's deal with Hippo and Drill Excadrill, my favorite, one of my favorite mons. <laughs> the fucking cat, the cat face. Yeah. All right. Um, let's go for Thunder Wave. For no, I can't Thunder Wave either of them. It's nothing what I'm doing there. Let's go for a good false surrender against Excadrill. And I'll knock off Excadrill as... No, I'll... Yeah, I'll Rock Smash Excadrill as well. Just try and batter down this Excadrill. Oh, fucking hell. Well, that's unfortunate. Rock Smash! Oh, that hit really goddamn hard. I forget how goddamn... <laughs> how beefy this Farfetch'd is. It's a lot better than a normal ass Kanto Farfetch'd, I know that much. I'm gonna bring in Vlob and then swap Vlob back out so Vlob gets some good experience. Bleh! Angry Bibby! Angry Poison Bibby! Alright, well. Uh, another Rock Smash for Excadrill, don't mind if I do. Yeah. That's not wrong, you're not wrong there, Seth. You're very true, you're very right on that. I'm not speaking from experience, I just know of situations where that sort of shit happens. That's why docs have a, no, have a confidentiality clause. I don't like to tell you what went down with people. Because sometimes those people got down with some naughty shit that they shouldn't have been getting down with. Anyway, uh, I'm a curse the hippo. Like, for oh, hello. Okay, I can only curse myself, so I can't actually choose who gets cursed. Interesting. Very interesting. Anyway, Excadrill. It's gonna dig now, and that's gonna take down Jamask, or it's gonna hurt Jamask. But Ex Excadrill's gonna lose its speed, so that's good. And then I can rock smash Excadrill and fuck him up. Yeah. Delete this from the stream. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Please remove this. <laughs> Do not Google that. No, don't. You don't want to know. It's definitely not another name for urethral insertion. Anyway, I'm going to kill this fucking hippo. Ah, <laughs> oh, fuck. Getting bitten. 
Alright, swapping hip abilities with Hippo. Which is just going to be a constant back and forth now, but the Hippo is cursed, thankfully. So, hey. The Hippo's not going to last long, because Hippowdon is a bastard to fight. It has so much defense. <laughs> Do not. <laughs> You've destroyed my good, wholesome, Christian friendly Pokemon stream! <laughs> yeah. Alright, um. Vlob, hello again. I'll send you back out again. You're literally just coming into farm experience, my dude. That's your job. Coltrane! Alright, I'm gonna go for a. I'm gonna go for a Rock Smash on Lucario. I wasn't expecting him to have more than one Pokemon each, admittedly. So that's kind of thrown a little wrench in my works. Coltrane. Ah, piss. Don't you dare. Rock Smash. Oh, Rock Smash is so good. Fuck it out. Wait, I wonder if this thing has Technician. That's maybe why Rock Smash is doing quite good damage. I reckon this Farfetch has the Technician ability, so weaker moves do good damage. Oh yeah, he's Pokemon are pretty good. Lucario and Hippowdon, both Gen 4s, both pretty solid mons. Uh, I'm gonna flame charge Lucario, set him on fire and blow his fucking life away while I get... Oh, I can only use Rock Smash because the Choice Scarf, shit. Well, that's unfortunate for me. That missed, nice one, good shot, idiot. Rock Smash. Cool. <laughs> nice. Very nice, sir. There we go. Lovely, lovely, level ups, level ups. And Flame Charge! Alrighty. Okay, uh, next up. Powdon's kit and weak. Curse is nearly over. Strife might be asleep, but I think this battle, for as long as it's gone on for, is uh, almost done. Nice. Uh, flame charge. Dead. I have anecdotes. <laughs> Not at all a foreboding statement. I have. Anecdotes! <laughs> mm. There we are. Hippo dead. Fucking Hippowdon never dies. It's an unkillable Pokemon, I swear to god. That's why I'm glad I have Curse right now. More level ups of Vlob. Vlob. Um, what even? What's happening? Oh, I've got to pick a new Pokemon, yeah. Oh, your battle's still going! Have you got another Pokemon, really? Fucking hell. You both of you. Alright, it's just a Perserker left. I can deal with a Perserker. I thought it was done there. I was confused why the battle was still going. Let's nuzzle the Perserker. Oh, no. Nope, she's going to slap the baby. Nice one, you big jerk. Don't slap the baby, Perserker. I know you're a Viking. And Vikings do some fucked up shit, but don't slap a baby. It's just insulting, if anything. Let's insult that baby. If you must defeat the baby in combat, it must be fair combat! Alright, flame charge the Viking. The Viking kitty. Oh, taunting. I mean, I was gonna attack you anyway, so that's fine. I will keep attacking you. Flame charge, and for kiss, I'd like you to use your night slash. There we are. Both. And Night Slash should do good damage. Hmm. Nice. <laughs> I love how oddly specific that is, JC, brilliant. Sorry, I was just so absorbed in the battle there, I wasn't noticing those embarrassing stories that we're sharing. You know this is going like on late on YouTube, right? Like a VOD? <laughs> just so you know. <laughs> oh dang. Just making sure you know before you like throw out anything too personal. 
Just so you know. Anyway. Here we go. <gasps> oh! Yeah, boy! Cut this. <laughs> What's called? I can't cut this. Coltrane's here! <laughs> but Coltrane, though! Oh! Oh! Fucking colossal! Look at this motherfucker! Look at him! Look at this fucking hench motherfucker! The vandalism of mines enrages it! Offenders are incinerated with flames! Fucking godlike! That's joining my team. He's on my team permanently. Tar shot. Um, pour sticky tar on the target. It lowers their speed. They become weak to fire moves. They become weaker to fire moves. That's all right. That's not a bad ability. Um, tell you what, I'll swap it out for smoke screen. There we are. You can get me demonetized. I'm far past that. Don't worry. I said I said some shit earlier. I think probably. I've probably said some shit throughout this. Anyway, let's go camping! Hey Lisa, let us camp together, huh? Hey Lisa, would you like to do camping with me? No, I don't want to camp- I don't want to camp like this. I want to camp with a different Pokemon, huh? Alright, uh, let's swap out for... Kiss up front. Let's- no, actually Vlob. I'll let Vlob do camping with all these cute fucking Eevees. I'm gonna be here a while just playing with these cute Eevees, aren't I? Whistle, whistle! Hey everybody! Whistle, whistle, whistle! Whistles for all! I have a wiggly toy! Oh hello, Espeon and Flareon! What are you two doing? How you doing? What the- Ah, oh, there you go! This is how you play with the game! I'll give it a wiggle and you attack it! Yeah, just mentioning trans people will do it. Fucking YouTube. Anyway. It's beyond do you give a fuck or... I guess you don't. Well, let's change toys. Ball! Fetch! Whoever gets it first wins my affections! Espeon! What about now? Fetch! Flareon, are you even? No, Flareon's giving the fuck up. Flareon doesn't care. Well, that's fine. Whip! Well, that's adorable as fuck. Uh, I'm now gonna move back to my menu. Nope. Go to my menu. I'm gonna do some cooking. <gasps> oh, Ivy did a cute noise. Oh, sorry. I need. Sorry, I need to actually carry on. Uh, I need to get Evie's attention. Evie! Oh my god! I get all the joy of playing Pokemon. Let's go, Evie, but that I haven't actually buy it or play it. Yeah, Evie! Yeah, boy! Evie, look at this. <laughs> the little angry eyebrows. Tell them my little guy just stops it. Like, yeah, what the fuck are you doing without me? <laughs> fuck are you doing? Hey guys, he wants to grab this first. He wants to play with it. Hey, hey, anyone? This is basically Nintendogs, but Pokemon. Pokemon is now slowly morphed more, in, more and more into being Nintendogs. And I'm okay with this. Anyway, fetch! Where's the other toy? Ball. No, where's the ball? I lost the ball. No, Espeon's got the ball. <laughs> Fucking Espeon. Oh, I can jiggle it. Ah, there you go. Now you two are getting into it. Hello, father, I require fun! <laughs> That's the baby! I require fun, father. Where is my father? Where is my fun? Alright, let us cook. Time to cook. Who's ready for dinner? Alright, I'm going to put in some good Ganlon berry. Controversial, but powerful. Light aftertaste. We want a lot of that. We want a lot of aftertaste in this curry. Uh, spicy and sweet, yes. Persim, oh good. Raspberry. 
A lot of rust, but more all the rust, Barry. There we go. Whoop! I want to see my little, my little angry poison baby just like glaring at me while I sit there trying to eat this food. I'm kind of excited for that moment. Did I just throw a packet of fucking ramen into the? Did I just throw fucking noodles into my curry? Okay. Whatever. This is fine. It's very on brand for me. Quick button presses, there we go. I don't know how to not burn that. Anyway, stirring time. Do I have to stir it slower or faster? There we are. I think I've got slower on this. I think I'll be going too fast on these. There we go. I like they're both looking sad right now. It's like, oh no. Oh no, that curry though. <laughs> What's wrong with the curry? How did we fuck this one up? I was doing so well with curries before. Oh wow, it's just noodles. Spicy instant noodles with curry in them! <laughs> I just tried to push the pot noodles and I poured some curry on top! <laughs> 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 Fucking BRB pot noodle! <laughs> Maybe the what are you doing? Don't eat that! Mm. Okay, well. Oh, apparently I really like the fucking noodles. Oh, that, was, that went all right. Okay, it came out okay. It's just the game was making me think I was fucking it up. The game was very just seemed very judgmental about that. Well, anyway, let us leave the camp finally. As great as that camp was. Experience. The food is adequate, and that pleases me, Father. You have supplied ample entertainment, Father. Alright, well, I guess we're going to have to go take on this uh, snow place now. I don't think I'm nearly ready enough for it, but let's go. Let's effing go, mate. Any Pokemon here that I've not caught before? Oh, one of them snow bug things. Yes, definitely want this. Snom! Its name is Snom! Its name! Is Snom fucking perfect? Perfect little angel. And it didn't get nuzzled there. It didn't suffer from electricity. Is it electric and snow? What the fuck? Oh well, anyway, um, let us come at Snom with. What do I go at it with? Ah, oh, fuck it. Kiss. Kiss, get in there and do some headbutts on Snom, please. I need Snom in my team right now. Like, I need Snom in my team two hours ago, at least. That's when I need Snom. God damn. God damn Snow. Alright, uh... Night Slash, fuck it. Try and get a hit out. Yep, got a hit out. Good. Struggle bug. Ouch. And Kari Nightmares in some of the Harvest Moon games. I have no idea, no for a reference for that, but cool. Sounds good. Sounds like a fun time. Curry related nightmares and such. Alright, I'm gonna go for a knockoff. Which hopefully shouldn't kill it. Yep, there we go. Low health, as I wanted. And Snom, you're going to be like the first bug Pokemon I've been able to find in this playthrough. I actually get on my team. I feel like all the bug Pokemon are so small that I, I don't see them when they're walking around in the grass. And that's why I've not caught any. But Snom, thankfully, I just about managed to spot. Great ball. One. Two. Three. Done. Snom. Do I need to give Snom a nickname? Snom's already kind of the best name I've ever heard of in my life. Snom is already kind of perfect. There's the conundrum that leaves me at. Does this need a nickname? 
Snom's Day is being added. Snom nom nom! It's a worm Pokemon, ice and bug. Spits out thread full of frigid energy. It ties its body to branches to disguise itself as an icicle! Snom nom nom! Snom nom nom. Nom, nom, nom. That's just enough spaces. Cool. Poifict. Couldn't be better. Fantastic, perfect Pokemon. Snom, nom, nom. You can go to the party, actually. Because we're about to put Coal Trade into the box anyway, so that saves us a journey. Snom, nom, nom is joining the party. Perfect. All right. Well, yeah. Character limits to this is good. Like twelve spaces is just enough for like a perfectly, a perfectly sized name. God oh, damn, my team. <laughs> my team's a little feeble at the moment. So I'm gonna have to buy a lot of items for this next gym battle. You can purchase more items. Good. Thank goodness. Ultra Balls! Yes, finally! Thank you! 30 of those. Nice. And three Premier Balls. And Hyper Potions? Yes. Yeah, back in the day. Five letters? I don't know if it was ever as bad as five, unless you were playing like a pirated game, but... It was definitely not a lot. That was like seven or eight, I think it was. Alright, I'm just kind of spending all my mons. Cool. I just need to check Pokedex for Snom. Let's see if I can suss out how many evolutions it might have. That is a mystery to me. Uh, I have no goddamn earthly clue. There's so many Pokemon I've not even remotely seen yet. Wow, there's so many I've just not been able to find. I imagine they're all like the wild area or something, but where was Blipbug at all this time? Like the generic bug Pokemon. Blipbug is found near the beginning. Wow, just all in the beginning areas. I just never ran into it. Never ran into it, despite it being all around there. Okay, cool. Such is life, I guess. Alright, let's get ourselves ready for the next big gym battle. Oh, but first there's a cafe here. I'll have a fight in the cafe just to test my... Uh, Current team strength. Hello. Hello, big terrifying friend. The food is very good here. You must have a proper meal here. Dish is cooked to perfection. What are you trying to do? Ruin your food? Welcome to Bob's Your Uncle. Alright. Wow, more new mons than any other Pokemon game. That's fucking great. Cool. I appreciate that a lot. Hmm, now. I'm trying to suss out. The freaky guy in the background, I'm going to assume that's Bob. Uncle Bob. Not leaving without enjoying a delicious meal. Would you like to serve me one, maybe? It'd be great if you served me one. Oh, it's a tapestry of the two brothers. Cool. Um, no one here is actually going to serve me food, is the thing. Y'all are all talking a big game about having great food, and no one's actually serving me. This is a terrible service. Goodbye. <laughs> wow. All right. Well. Oh, look at this goddamn Roman bathhouse. Cool. Shouldn't forget about Challenger David, you're damn right. Draco Meteor. I ain't got any dragon types. Persian engraved on this wall? Probably. Heroes Bath. The Ancient Heroes. Good hot spring. God, I could not go to a hot spring in the fucking snow because it's like, yeah, when you're in the water, it must be so fucking hot and so nice. But when you get out, you must be so cold, though. Oh, because you're wet and it's snowing. Ugh, God. I would never want to get out of the water for how cold it would be. I'll just be trapped in there indefinitely, I guess. Anyway. 
Over here. I'm not good in the snow, in case you noticed. Darumaka can store strength in the cold. Ah. Oh. <laughs> I think I'm actually Dio. <laughs> nice. I mean, that's reasonable. I've definitely starred myself after him, so... Easy mistake to make. Easy assumptions to make. Even my hair looks like part one Dio. It's kind of the perfect hair. And uh, I'll tell you what, I think I've explored this town to its fullest. Let's go deal with the gym battle now. I'll try to anyway. See how hard I get bodied with my very underleveled team. Hello. You're going to battle me before I even get in there? Oh wow, he lost here. I'm not the only one then. Hmm. It's the rock lead. Oh, it's a rock gym. Okay. I could do a rock gym, I'm pretty sure. Gordy. Gordy the rock guy. Hmm. Got to figure out what to put on my team once and for all. I like the fact that he always goes at you with all different... Fuck it out. All completely different teams. Like... That feels... that I like that that justifies why every time you battle him he's like a completely different trainer. Because that's like part of his actual character arc is rejigging his team until it's perfect. Anyway, moon balls. I'm good at catching like four Pokemon specifically. Really rubbish Pokeballs. They look cool though. They look very cool. A Rocky Horror themed gym. Nice. Good idea. Um... I'm as ready as I'm ever going to be. The Inverness Gym. Sure. Is Inverness known for its rocks? I mean, yeah, of course it is. Yeah. There you go, then. Uh, This is actually going to be Strife's time to shine. Wow. Strife, I need you to break some fucking rocks for me. Can you do that? I think you can. I don't see why you couldn't. Riff Raff. <laughs> nice. All right. Uh, okay, who am I going to give? I'm going to give it to Snom Nom Nom. I'm going to give Snom Nom Nom the... Oh, what should I give him? Uh, any of these actually going to be helpful at all? If anything, I should give you the EVO life. I don't know what to give you. Maybe the Wise Glasses, because it's snowy. Yeah, I'll give the Wise Glasses. Special Attacks. Boost the special attacks. Yeah, I like that I'm just focusing on the Pokemon League thing. Alright, I've got Run the Impsy. Doesn't work when I say it like that. Run the Impsy. There we are. Gotta proper emphasize it so the joke works. I've got Kiss there, who. What should Kiss have? This should have a silk scarf. No, yeah, silk scarf. This should do good damage with normal type moves. No, it doesn't use normal types. It's dark type. Uh, it's always the fun part of Pokemon inventory management. Fun part of any RPG. I bet people love watching me do this. It's great. Um, hmm. Yeah, I think I just have to go with silk scarf. Uh, jam mask with OVO light. Strife choice scarf, so you can just sma slam enemies with that. Rock Smash, but I might actually teach him a different, a better move for Rock Types. So, bag, TMs, and I know I have that Punch Attack. What was it? Um, revenge. Was it Revenge? Yes. I'm gonna make sure both Strife and Run D Impsy learn Revenge. There we are. Cool. Swap out Rock Smash for that. One, two, poof. And run DMC, also with revenge. And for that, I will get rid of Torment. I never really use Torment. There we are. Yeah, there's no. This is far from Pokemon Insurgents, where it's just legendaries, legendaries, legendaries. There's cults and evil teams everywhere. It's like that. Just let me play Pokemon. Let me go to the gyms and fight gym leaders and have fun. Yes, good. Thank you. I have to change my uniform? Of course I do. 
I have to stop being Dio Brando for just a moment. There we go. That's better. And I get a trap detector as well. Oh boy. So I'm going to get bodied by traps in this gym. That's fun. Can't wait to have rocks fall on my head. Rocks fall, I die. There we are. Oh, you wanted to do gardening and your seedlings aren't ready? I'm sorry to hear, my dude. That sucks. Alright, now what do I do with these? <laughs> now a regular human ran Dio Brandon. <laughs> cool. There's invisible pitfalls. If you fall in, you have to start again. The detector vibrates when there's a pitfall in front of you. Um, I might have a problem with this. Let me see. Let me just check. Alright, um, my controller doesn't vibrate. <laughs> so, we gone. Oh, okay, it, it does a visual though. It does a visual at least. Where do I go then? That all looks like it's... Actually, it all looks dangerous. No, I'm good here. There we are. Alright. Fun gimmick. I like it here. This is a great place. I love this place. Baldor! Go on, Vlob. Baby Vlob with the nappy. And your inability to really do any damage to anyone ever. Yeah, I'm not going to use you. Here comes, here comes Strife. Strife time. With his big dang leak. Ready to slam a motherfucker in the head. Oh, Don't, please. Thank you. Alright. I'm going to have to get revenge for that one. Secret theme, yeah. Sounds about right. Alright, revenge! Strife Revengeance! Oh god, that fucking hit hard. Wow. God damn. <laughs> that was... I keep underestimating Strife's actual power. I need to start using Strife more. Strife's constantly been getting bodied in my team. has not been always bad matchup-wise. But now I'm actually using him. It's like, fuck, that hit though. That fucking hit though. That's all definitely not safe. Piss! Well, that's annoying. Might as well just fu Why am I just being so slow and cautious? Why don't I just fucking keep going? Fuck it. Oh, that's also a trap. Never mind. I'll just keep going until I eventually get it. Up this way. Yep, cool. Done. This is for Aerith. <laughs> nice. Alright, well. That was nice and simple. Up here we go. Oh, no, no, no. No, 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 not at all. Don't agree with any of that. Fuck! Alright, going forward is clearly not okay. Going left is not okay. I guess I've got to go to the right and kind of navigate around awkwardly. Go the back ways. Nope. Pit in the corner where no one would go, yes. Ah, oh, fucking trial and error, same again. Just feels like a better way of doing this. There we are. Ah, okay, got that one out of luck. Sheer dumb luck. Cool. Fucking YOLO! <laughs> Death traps of the week! I'll just recover from the damage once I've been hit by them. Yeah, I could avoid the pain, but alternatively, I'll just tank it all. Alright, uh, back to strafe. 
Right, Strife's not going to be as good because Cross is partly bug type as well. But still pretty tough, I feel. So. Oh, fuck it out. It's pretty hard. It might have the move Shell Smash. If it does, I'm in big trouble. I'm just hoping it doesn't have Shell Smash. Shell Smash is one of the most overpowered moves in all the Pokemon. Uh, introduced in Gen 5, it doubles all your attack powers, doubles your speeds, and halves all your defenses. But, having your defenses slash is all well and good, but not if you're so quick and powerful that you're going to destroy the rest of the battle anyway. At that point, having shit defense means nothing. You're not going to get hit. No one's going to be able to hit you. So yeah. Crosser looks way better in 3D, that is agreed. He looked awkward as hell in its original incarnation. Anyway, uh, I'm gonna go for that. Revenge! Revenge! Oh, Stealth Rock. Fuck, Stealth Rock is a thing in this. Fuck. Gotta be careful then. No more swapping. No more swapping mons or I'm gonna get them battered by rocks. Alright, uh, knock off. See if you've got any items. Nope, I can only use Revenge now. I'm waiting for you to hit me so I can hit you back harder. Nice. Revenge! Rules of nature! There we are. Uh, I had the potion again for strife. If I had super potions, I'd be using them, but I don't. Never mind. I forget that sometimes I don't need to heal a, a bazillion hit points in this. Sometimes. Use that good buster leak. That's what it is. It really is just like a buster sword leak. The more I look at it, yeah. And revenge! Cool. That's you dead. There's two of the mons down. And that's Kira. I'm kind of glad I ended up going to a rock gym at this point in the game where I've got like a kind of a poorly optimized team because rock types are quite exploitable and quite easy to beat in a lot of contexts. So yeah. Usually they're the first gym in the game, and that's usually for a reason. They're quite easy to overcome. Then again, I'm, I'm saying all this now, and they might fucking throw me for a loop with this one. We'll see. Just doing a cloud, a cloud sword spin at the end of the battle? Fuck yes. I would l fucking live for that shit if that happens. Anyway, um, let's bring in... Not snom, not snom nom nom, not for cold monster. Uh, we'll go for run DMC. Let's go for that. <clears throat> See how run DMC does dealing with a revenge. I wonder if it'll be anywhere near as effective. Let's see. Uh, in fact, I don't even really need the revenge. I've got these moves. I'm going to use it anyway because it's got the super effectiveness. Oh, and it is still faster than me, so I'm going to take a hit. The hit's not going to kill me, but it is going to make my revenge stronger. And the crit just makes me angrier! Perfect. Alright, good. Very good. Now I'm burned. That sucks. That's not good at all. That's actually quite bad. But if you're going to do the same thing again, I think we're going to win. Flame charge. Not enough to kill me, but enough to piss me off, enough for revenge to kill you. Even though I'm burnt and my attack's weakened. Good. Lovely. Oh yeah, we were thinking of calling this Miku, but it turned out to be a dude, so yeah. Oh, I mean Strife, yeah. Far-fetched. What with the leak and such. Anyway, there goes Oliver. Alright. YOLO, motherfuckers! <laughs> this is how we do. Oh, God. You know what's really annoying? Like, the sound effects that happen when you fall down the pits. It's like a weird audio optical illusion that makes me think that someone's, like, tapping on the desk behind me. Every time, the same as the time I fall down a pit, I keep spinning around instinctively. I don't know what that's about, but yeah. Anyway. Oh, fuck. 
Are you joking? Are you joking? Oh, come on. Yeah, this is fucking trying to break through the diamond wall in that one episode. God damn. Heaven sent. Oh, okay. Well, I got through that bit. That was alright. Who's up here? Who is even up here? I can't even see you. Hello. I know you're there. How? <laughs> How do you know I'm here? Well spotted, Wendy. Everyone in this gym should be wearing goggles. This is a hazard to all of your health. Alright, uh, let's swap to... Strafe. Assuming a pseudo widow doesn't bat me in one hit. Should be able to get a little bit of progress with Strife here. And revenge and such. Oh, god damn, hits hard. Even not very effective, that was enough to beat me. Alright, well. Run D Impsy. Yep, there we are. But he's also burned, so he's not going to do much. Revenge. Nope. <laughs> Oh, such thirst for revenge! Ooh. Okay, um... Yeah, beaten by a big fuck-off twig. With big damn muscles. Um, wow, Snom Nom Nom has fuckle moves. Wow. Level 41! <laughs> Jesus! Um, let's go for... Jamask? Yeah, Jamask. What up, motherfucker? Get cursed! Time for cursing! Dink, 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 nail to the brain. Well, worth it. <laughs> worth it, AF. Nice. Alright, and next up comes some curse damage. And also the damage from your own hammer. Good. And uh, all my Pokemon left are like the poor ones. <laughs> the weak ones. Good. Uh, baby doll eyes. Please don't hurt me. Please, I'm just an innocent little Linoon. <laughs> Yeah, I ain't gonna fucking fly, is it? Come on. Dink. Oh, wow. That actually was pretty good. That that helped to resist all that good damage. Well. Alright then, well. Tell you what. Am I quick enough to kill you with Night Slash? I'm quick enough to finish you off with Night Slash. Damn, kiss. Damn, kiss. Sweet. There we are. See the Wido down. Surprisingly, with Kiss. Alright. Uh, I'd rather keep Headbutt, because Takedown does loads of damage to me. And also, Vlob is levelling up too! Hooray! When will Vlob finally evolve, I hope? Please tell me Vlob will finally evolve. Yeah, Kiss is very good. Very open your eyes to things you could not see before. Thank you for the hint. YOLO! Piss! Alright, well. This is how we do when you're David. This is how David deals with problems. Yep. Yep! <laughs> well. I deserve that last one. <laughs> that last one was my, entirely my own fault. That was hubris. That's what hubris looks and sounds like. I fucking instinctively turned around again. It does sound like something's behind me. Ugh. Alright, cool. Okay, let's do some revivication on the squad. There's a max revivication for Strife. Some revives for Run D Imp C. There we are. 
Uh, some Hyper Potion. I'm going to give that to Jamask and run DMC. Kiss, I don't think, needs it so much. So, yeah. Uh, we could do. I feel like all these Pokemon are going to evolve with leveling up, but if you could just double check them and make sure they see if that is the case, then sure, I guess. If anything, it just means the Pokemons that have really obscure, obfuscated ways of leveling up, or evolving rather, are the Pokemon that I'm going to end up using, because they're the ones I'll level up the most. So, And then when I do learn how to have them reach their final forms, I'm going to be like, yeah, good, finally. Nice. I'll get the satisfaction of that, but we will see, yeah. You need the actual name. Oh, depends which one you're looking for. Um, meh. Well, don't worry too much anyway. If there's any particular where it's, they're getting to a stupidly high level and I don't know what the fuck's going on, then uh, I'll give you a shout. Although, I have just realised, I think Jam Mask evolves with the Dusk Stone. I think Confagrigus appears when you give Jam Mask a Dusk Stone, not level it up. I think. Oh, see you shortly, JC. Have a good one. Well, either way. Keep going in and out of menus. I'm very decisive right now. Let's swap to Strife. Bye. Bye bye. Here we go. With my little dowsing machine. Gym Challenger, join me on the pitch of battle. Yeah, mask is level. Oh, wow. Okay, cool. It's just a high level. Alright, I was just starting myself because it's gotten high now. Hello! Ah, this guy, the guy who looks like adult Steven and adult PD kind of mashed together. Gordy. Anyway, I'm going to use this match to show the crowd that my Pokemon are unbeatable. You have fun with that. I'm going to get my bird to hit you really hard with a leak until you break. That's my plan. Let's go against Gordy and his Barbarical. That's a good start. Oh, fuck. Hello. Okay. Oh, you searched the wrong generation. Okay, well. Anyway, um. Let's go in with a. Revenge! Fucking what? How? Whoa! Jesus Christ, okay. Is this even winnable? If you could just do that much damage to me, effortlessly? With a dusty bowl, oh. I assume that's an item that I need to give it. Huh. Anyway. That's interesting. Curse. Mmm. Why? So OP. Fuck off, my dude. Get rid of your tough claws. They're gone now. I'm also going to curse you. You're going to die in four turns. And that's what you get for being jammy with your fucking razor shells. There you go. Boom. Nice. Okay, so... <clears throat> Next up we have... Snom nom nom, run DMC. Yeah, Galar Yamask evolves differently. Alright, well... I might stop... I might take him out of the party for a little while until I can figure out what, how to actually evolve him. Anyway, uh... Hmm... <sighs> I'm not digging how fucking powerful this Barbarical is and how much it's just tearing through my guys. There we are. Oh, Shell Smash, are you for real? No! Fuck you! Oh, fuck you for using that. Hate that. Oh, but that's fine because I have Sucker Punch. You're dead now. If you try and attack me with that stupidly OP attack you've just given yourself, I'm gonna punch you in the face and you're gonna explode. From the impact alone. Sucker punch. 
Yeah, that's what you get for using Shell Smash. Fuck off. Oh, it didn't even kill him? Piss her off. Well, it's gonna kill him now. The curse will do it. Even though I didn't manage to. Nope. Ow. Alright, I think getting rid of Barbarical was the most important first step, because Barbarical is ridiculous in terms of its damage output. Now it's gone. So... I can actually make some progress now, hopefully. We shall see. Experience points. Hmm. Alrighty. Next is Shuckle. Okay. Do not fuckle with Shuckle. Are you going to be a shitty Shuckle? Are you going to be the kind of Shuckle that uses Toxic and then just starts spamming defense and shit? So I just can't win? I hope not. I'm going to knock off. I'm going to knock you off just in case. If you have any items, you get rid of them. Doesn't have items. He's just attacking me. That's a dumbass Shuckle you've got there. Huh. Right, okay. What if I revenge? I can only knock off now. I need to swap out. I need to swap out. Hmm. I feel like there's a trick to this Shuckle. There's clearly something more to it than just a Shuckle that's going to attack me. Because Shuckle is like the worst attacker in the game. His defenses are ridiculous, but his attacking potential is just gone. It's just non-existent. Okay, maybe against an icy bug it's pretty good, but I mean otherwise. Let's change to strife again. Hmm, alright. And now, let's use a Hyper Potion on Strife. Sweet! I'm trying to suss out that thing you've put in the chat, Seth. I feel like maybe my Yamask needs to be level 49 and we'll get a move named Dusty Bowl, or there'll be an item I run into called Dusty Bowl, and then only with those together will it evolve. I don't know, maybe. Anyway. Let's go in with that revenge. Yeah, you hit me rocks, I hit you with a stick. That's our arrangement. I hope you like the arrangement. Please stop getting crits on me. What in the fuck is with the constant crits, though? <laughs> Don't like that at all. Revenge. No, don't worry. Uh, don't worry too much. I kind of think I get what you mean. I just assume Dusty Ball is either an item or a move. I'm just not sure which. Anyway, keep bapping the shuckle. All right, so this shuckle might have been the easiest gym enemy I've faced so far. Because all it can really do is rock tomb and lower my speed. Which okay, sure. I don't really need speed. Speed actually help. Having low speed helps me when I'm using revenge. So yeah. Anyway, next up is Stonjourner. What the fuck is you? The fuck is Stonjourner? I is my Pokemon, Stonjourner. Okay, sure. Well, um. I'm gonna take down your stun jar With my big burb. Oh my god, I just realised he kind of reminds me of Guts. The big fuck off weapon and the angry eyebrows gives me a Guts feeling. Feels very berserk right now. This motherfucker. Anyway. Just swapped its defense to special defense, and I think that's the last thing it wanted to fucking do. Whoops. Idiot. <laughs> and that just made me more powerful. Goodbye, Stonjourner. And your last man. We can still battle. Colossal. 
Are you gonna get a fucking Gigantamax Colossal against me? Let's see, I'm definitely curious. I'm using a high proportion just in case. And the next turn I'm gonna get the attack on. Oh man, this is gonna look sick! Very good though. The thing is though, he's very, very good. Ugh, ouch. Mm. Didn't need that in my face. And now he's made it sunny also. So the next time he does that, it's gonna kill me. So let's use Max Gar to block this next Dragantamax move. Cool. But now I can't do shit on this next turn. Fuck. <laughs> uh oh. Kinda lost my only ace in the hole. Whoops. You know what? Snom nom nom. It was nice knowing you. I'm going to have to sentence you to death. I'm gonna have to sentence you to an incredibly painful death. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god! I think statistically, the amount of damage I just received is probably the highest amount of damage you can possibly achieve in a game of Pokemon. Fuck me. Okay, well. Uh, Kiss. If I get you to come in, he'll strike for the next turn. And then when Big Boy gets small. Strife can come in and deal with him. Yep, there we go. Alright, well. One more Hyper Potion for Strife. Tell you what, this really was Strife's time to shine, really, it wasn't it? Like, after that last gym battle where he was more of a liability, admittedly. Now he's really kind of come into his own, and he's kind of soloed this battle. And the perfect ending would be if he evolved and became Surfetch now. That would be the perfect ending to this. Anyway, revenge. Fucking pisshead. Fuck you. Well, that's annoying. That's incredibly annoying. Um, hmm. This is not good. Baby. Alright. Revive for... Uh, Jam Maskia. There we are. God, Heat Crash is... Fucking a lot. It's fucking too much, is what it is. All right, highest defense I've got by a my by a wide margin in my team is Jam Mask. I feel like, especially with the EVO light. So, if Heat Crash kills me on this next turn, I don't think I have anything that can actually stop this guy. Because <laughs> if he can kill Strife in one hit, then there's just nothing I can do. Unless he runs out of heat crashes or something. If I, unless I stall him out until he runs out of those. Okay, cool. Nice. Let me just check what that ability I just got is. No, I'd like to know what the ability I just received is. I don't know what the ability is. Uh, must have look at stat boosts or stat changes. Ah, there we go, Steam Engine. Can I look at what Steam Engine does? Boost the stat speeds drastically if hit by fire or water. Okay. Uh, neither of that helps me. <laughs> Alright, um... He's not even taken half my health off with that Steam attack, so... I'm going to go for another revive on... my Angry Duck Boy. While you just burn your heat crashes out. On me. 
And that's going to make me faster. Good. Perfect, 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 perfect. All right. Got it. I know what to do. Fully heal. Jam mask. Noise. And now he's realised if he keeps using that, he's going to make me stronger. So he stopped using it to try and slow me down again. Which gives me a curse opportunity. Battle over. Love, curse, so goddamn OP. Great ability. That's what you get. Nah. <laughs> nah, though. It's the thing. Nah. Like, yeah, okay, that's fine. That's okay. You ain't gonna beat me with it. Not when I use my next type of potion. You can't stop me. Got ya. And there goes Kualossal. He's just going to start spamming that tomb now and intend to beat me with it. But there's not really much he can do. I think, to put it bluntly, he's burned himself out. Nice. And Shadow Ball. And that should be it. Well, no, okay, our Shadow Ball's fucking nothing. Never mind. The curse will do it. It's the curse I really want. It's the curse I care about. It's the curse that's going to do all the damage. La, la, la. La, 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 la. And you're dead. No amount of heat crash will save you now. That only makes me more powerful! <laughs> you dead. And there goes Colossal! That's what you get for heat crashing my most devastating mon. I'm proving to be a bastard about it. And there goes Gordy! Just want to climb into a hole. <laughs> Guess it'd be more like falling from here. Baby! <laughs> Sorry, I that sounded really weird. Baby! <laughs> What's vlog gonna turn into? Fucking edgy teen! Toxtricity! He has become edgy ass fucking teenager, is what he's become. Toxtricity added to the Pokedex. When his Pokemon. When this Pokemon sounds as if it's strumming on a guitar, it's actually clawing at the protrusions on its chest to generate electricity. It's like fucking Kira. It's like fucking Chili Pepper. <laughs> a Kira, not Kira. Yeah, amped form. Nice. He wants to learn how to spark. That sounds about right. Punk is not dead. Punk lives on in this Pokemon. One, two. Ta-da! You've learned how to spark. Fuck yeah. <laughs> that was impressive. Yes it was. Here's the rock badge. Can now catch Pokemon up to level 50. Nice. And I get an extra TM. Rock Tomb. Of course it's Rock Tomb. You love that goddamn move. When you realise that Heat Crash would just fuck him over more. He kind of stopped. He's like, he's kind of fell back on that. So yeah. Cool. Cool beans. Hello. Ball guy. Goodbye ball guy. <laughs> You're an abomination ball guy. Alrighty. I did have trouble, I'm not going to lie, I'm not going to pretend I didn't have trouble. That is intellectually dishonest for me to claim that. This game proved more difficult than I thought it would. Um, Alright, Pokedex. <clears throat> Alright, let's go down in Pokedex a bit. See if I can find this, uh... See if I can find these little guys, so... 
so many Pokemon I've probably just overlooked. Um, Toxel, Toxtricity. Toxtricity is the final form as well. It's probably dope as fuck and really powerful and really cool, but, you know, it's final form, so I'll pop it in the box and I'll let someone else get a little time to shine, a little time in the sun. 